Is your mom as stupid as mine is? She's a good mom. She's not a good mom. No. She what? said she's not a good is your, mom. Is your mom just as stupid as mine? Like, come on. <laughs> what is wrong with this kid? Right. He's something else. What's happening with it, YouTube? Today's a different type of video. We about to react to a show called, what's it called again? What would you do? What would you do? Apparently this show is, or this was this was an episode, I should say, talking about children that are spoiled. You know what I'm saying? When their parents do a bunch of stuff for them or they just kind of let their kids get away with stuff like that. I think it's called Rude Kids That Belittle Their Parents. That belittle their parents, man. After they feeding them, giving them food for their mouth, you know, showers and toilet paper for their ass. All and all the above they just rude you know what i'm saying but listen you are back in the den don't get it up twisted confused if you don't know where you are we about to get into this video and see what it do man if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe make sure you comment and always share and uh you know anything else you want to turn your notifications on so that you know every time we drop a video so that you can tune in and come and chill with us in the den, the den. right on so let's get into the video David, remember, we're living off of one paycheck now, okay? Hey, we only have $100 to spend. Okay, Mom, I get it. You're getting divorced. I'm not an idiot. All right. Like, it's my... Wait, wait a minute. Let me, let me just stop it, man, first of all. I just want to say this. If somebody walk into a store and my mama is somebody and they like, listen, man, we only we coming to get some shoes and we only got $100 to spend, I wouldn't be walking into no store that look like that. What about you? You know what I'm saying? I might I might be going to Walmart or something like that if, if it's $100. I'm just saying, though. First of all, if I have to walk in a shoe store or clothes store with my child and tell them, I only have $100, is this real situations or is this just- This is real situations. This oh. is the hidden camera, the dude they go in there and he she could be in the back and they test the situation and then he come out and be like i'm such and such from just like the one where they do the, the pedophile dude what was your plan today? nothing actually just to hang out just to hang out yeah with a 13 year old boy yeah but this is the other guy i'm just confused as i would not walk in the store and necessarily tell my kid you know i only have a hundred dollars to buy shoes i would probably just if it was that type of situation i would just pick the shoes for my kid <laughs> like, right right i, I only mean, have a hundred dollars i would have just know? been like dude we're hey, going to we, we gonna go get some twenty dollars we're going to the goodwill man you know what i'm saying or I, maybe like you said i would have just i would have just gave it the shoes man right. you know what i'm saying right. like listen hey santa came early i picked these up for you man Man, here you is. But anyway, let's get let's keep rolling. My problem? Oh, why? You're so annoying. Ooh, Ma, I want these. They're only two hundred dollars. Oh, honey, I'm sorry. They're too expensive. I can't get you're so annoying out of my head. Like, did he just tell his mom she's so annoying? He did. When he she's did. about to buy him a pair of shoes. She, she just, he just said it, man. I would have slapped the shit out of his ass. Right? Shit out of his then, ass. And then I would have slapped the word annoying out of his vocabulary. Exactly. Yeah, that's what I would have like, did. Uh -uh. Straight up. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm listening. I don't know what planet they from, but $200, man? Man. Didn't listen. she tell you that she only had $100 <laughs> to begin with? Right. Oh, mom, I want these shoes. They're only $200. I think he want her to pull it out his ass. Or she want... He she, want her to pull it out of her, her ass. ass. That's right. Anyway, let's keep rolling. I want. This is exactly why I wanted to live with dad. Please, lower your voice. No, you're like the stupidest, most selfish mom ever. No wonder dad left. Okay. He just told her that's why he wants... He wanted to live with dad. Well, I would have said at that right there at the moment that there's the door and don't let the motherfucker hit you, okay? With all that attitude and the way he acted, yeah. maybe he needs to live with his dad. Yeah. The question is, you think the daddy would have bought the shoes? I don't know what the daddy would have did because the daddy not here, but the way he talking, the daddy need to get in his ass. Get in his ass is right, man. Listen, if he keep acting like that, I'm going to have to go up to the penitentiary and somebody going to straight get in his ass. Daddy's got a sweet tooth tonight! And he's in public talking to his mom like that like i want to jump through the screen and whip his ass like mm. unacceptable very unacceptable let's listen do you tell the boy to step in his mom's shoes and show some respect do you give the mom some parenting advice or do you simply sneak away from this very personal situation 
What would you do? Please don't say such hurtful things. Stop being such an idiot and just buy me the stupid shoe. This is about what would you do if you were in a store, you were in a situation and someone walked in and you found yourself caught up hearing and seeing a situation before your eyes and ears. Right. What would you do? What would you do? Would you step in and say something or would you turn the cheek like the good old book says? Like the good old book says, turn the cheek, huh? You want to tell you to turn the cheek? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think it does. It says turn the other cheek. If you get, you know, smacked, you got to turn the cheek. Thank you, sir. May I have another? Yeah, well, I mean, that depends on which cheeks we're talking about. <sighs> These are nice. They're black like that. Um... Why are you being so dumb? I'm telling you what I want. They're cheap and ugly. It might look like this guy is too tied up to hear what's happening, but he's all ears. You're being selfish and stupid. He's a parent himself, and his patience with David's rude behavior is hanging by a shoestring. We can't afford them. I need you to understand that. We can't afford. Yes, we can. Being such an idiot. Shouldn't have told you another way that, though. told me that, I would smack the crowd. She's being dumb, dude. They're only 200. You want to only afford what she can afford. That's it. Don't talk to you mother like that. We send Lorraine back in. So you're giving me the money? First of all, he called his mom dumb. Right. I mean, come on now. I am so happy that this is a setup because he's really playing that part to the teeth. But I know that there's some rude and crude kids like that. Right. Um, I personally, I would have said something. I think that I probably would have said something. I probably would have been like, hey, youngster, you know what I'm saying? That, you know, you should chill out, man, or be cool. Even though I wouldn't have said nothing like that to my mama, it's, it's you know, it, it, the type of kid it is. Because me personally, you know, somebody would have said that to me and I was with him, I probably would have been like, mind your business, man. <laughs> you know what I mean? Actually, so. actually, I kind of, I would have waited to kind of see how the mom was going to handle it. And if I seen that she was a little weak, then yeah, I would have definitely stepped in and said something to them both. What if mama would have said, mind your business? Well, maybe she deserves to be talked to like that. It's, it's true. the reason it's why true. she's being talked to like that. Let's listen. See, if I was trying to agree with the way he was talking to you, I don't like that at all. To have children with myself. I'm just so overwhelmed that I don't know what to do. I don't know how it feels to be overwhelmed, but you, you shouldn't allow them to speak to you like that at all. If she could just buy me the shoes, I would stop you. She shouldn't. Rent. She shouldn't have to. Me. If she can only give you $100 for a pair of sneakers, that's it. You should be grateful for that. <laughs> All right, so the last dude, man, I think that he was 100 with it. I agree with that. You know, I mean, listen, let me tell you something, man. You know, the children of the world is the future. So if that's how we got running around, that's the respect they have. And if they got that type of respect for their own mama, what kind of respect you think they gonna have for you? you believe my mom, man? She'll let me get these. Well, she's buying you something, right? Well, yeah, but these are the only ones I want. Yeah, but at the end of the day, I mean, she's spending her, her hard-earned money to get you something. And like an older, wiser brother, he seizes this teachable moment. I've got to the point where I can make my own money now, so I can buy my own shoes. But until then, yeah, my mom bought me stuff. You know, I was always thankful. The least you can do is say thank you. Just say thanks. Caught between mom and her combative son, is this next woman. You stop being so stupid, just tell her stop being so stupid. I'm sorry. They said, would you tell her to stop being so stupid? Stop being so stupid. <laughs> like, look, if I, what was that with you? What would you would have said? Would you tell her to stop being stupid? I would have said the same thing the girl said. Like, don't you be sorry. Like, I mean, wow. Wow. Yeah. You need to stop being so stupid. True that, true that. I need a minute. Mm -hmm. She tries to play peacemaker. Is your mom as stupid as mine is? She's a good mom. She's not a good mom. No. She what? said she's not a good is your, mom. Is your mom just as stupid as mine? Like, come on. <laughs> what is wrong with this kid? Right. He's so else. I'm getting these shoes. Give me the money. I'm not going to give you that. If looks could chastise. What are we going to do? Because I'm not leaving without these shoes. I can't get them. I wish I could. She, she looked like she was visualizing whipping her ass. <laughs> she, was, she was visually whipping her ass in her mind. She was like. Yeah, she was just looking like at odd. Like I just wish I can put my hands around this little girl and just shake her up. But, yeah, she's you know. whipping her ass. She, what's that people say? And looks can kill. Right. Yeah. Right. I just just try these on. Maybe they'll look good on you. They're ugly. I'm not putting those on my feet. 
A deep breath seems to help her stay quiet until she hears this. My dad is so stupid. Don't say that. He's not stupid. Yes, he is. He's not buying me the shoes. He works hard for what he has. Don't call him stupid. You're embarrassing him right now. He's embarrassing me. He wants me to put ugly shoes on my feet. How old are you? I'm 13. Don't act like that. It's I want these. You look really spoiled right now. I really wanted these shoes. Why don't you get a job and then get them yourself? I'm not old enough. Duh. OK, so when you get a job, then you can get them yourself. Duh. Not getting anywhere with Sophia, she offers some advice to the put-upon pop. Walk out the store and don't get her anything. The more you keep giving her the things that she asked for like this, the behavior will continue. Let me stop right there. What's your thoughts on her, man? Because to me, I get it. She wants to help out. But at the end of the day, it's like she did. She just jumped in. She doing that. She going to do this. Someone needed to tell the kid that. Someone mm. needed to tell her. Her dad is not telling her. Obviously, the mom is not telling her. So someone needed to tell her. I think she reacted in that way. Was it the correct way or proper way to react? It's not my. I mean, hey, I wouldn't have necessarily acted that way or said what she said. But someone definitely needed to tell the little girl. If you don't like it, get a job. Get your own shoes. Well, yeah. You can't do that, though. Sure. 13. Mm, no job. But I mean, hey, 13 years old, you can shovel shit, sell candy bars. There's all kind of shit you can and do. And your parents have to pay you. That's right. Let's keep moving. You're a mom? I'm a mom. How old are you? Four-year-old. And my stepson. <laughs> That's my heart broke for him. You don't have to get them everything they want. You don't have to. All you gotta do is love them. And they'll, they'll appreciate that. You're being so difficult. I'm being difficult? If you would just buy me the stupid shoes, then there would not be a problem. I can't get those shoes. I feel sorry for you because that would not be my daughter. Excuse me? <laughs> she said, I feel, it's almost like, I feel sorry for your mother. You know, like men society. I feel sorry for your mother. What the fuck you say about my mom? Well, she just jumped in the conversation, man. I don't know. It's kind of puzzling because I get it. I don't know if that was me in that position. I wouldn't have probably said Your it. personality, maybe you wouldn't say anything, but I dog on sure would say something. Like if I saw a kid, You wouldn't have just minded your business? No. What? Obviously something's wrong. You in the store and your kid is talking to you like that, something's obviously wrong and someone needs to step in. My grandma would have just did it right there in the store to you. I told you! And she wouldn't have told the people, listen, you got a problem with it call the police not to test me <laughs> you know what i'm saying so that's one of the reasons i say things have changed now and it causes other people to get involved we you know you know yeah that's what i think but let's keep rolling it's the abuse towards her she won't back down next time you need to mind your own business because now i'm not getting the shoes because of you <laughs> Stop being cheap. I can't afford those. Dad, this is why mom divorced you, because you're so freaking cheap. Sophia. Shanae and Thomas clearly hear what's happening. I'm sorry, my dad is so stupid. I'm sorry you got to see that. That'd be good though, he ain't getting sleep. He's got to be great. But he's being stupid. He's not getting me the one that I want. Yeah, let's not be just stupid. Maybe he don't have it. You say he can't afford So you should get something that you can afford. And you know, go out to eat with that. My father, you take me to school. I could get joy and stuff like that. I mean, you about to get some expensive sneakers. Yeah. Well, what do you think? What's the definition of stupid? Uh, my dad. I don't know, man. I'm speechless. She, she but, was too. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, I'm just glad that this is what would you do? You know what I mean? Like, cause, um, yeah. For me, I like the show. I mean, I think it's a really good way to put people out there to see how people react to situations in public. I mean, things like that, especially with children and kids today. But it's crazy, man. Homeboy was funny, but he was telling the real and then the lady in the beginning. But actually, I knew a kid just like that. Real talk, he lost his mom early and he just paying for it today. But anyways, that's what that is. If you got something you, something you want to add there? Be nice to your parents. They buy you things, they put roots over your head, they feed you, be kind. Unless they child abuse at you, then obviously that might be a different story. But don't abuse them. Right. But don't get abused. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, if your parents are doing weird things and, you know, like things you don't think is right. Hey, we're talking about rude kids and spoiled kids. Oh, okay. If you don't know where you are, you are in the den. Don't get it twisted up or confused. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Like the video. And Turn your notifications on. Correct, though. Comment down below. Tell us what would you do.